Hey guys, Greg with BTOD TV and BTOD.com. In today's weight capacity comparison, we're going to be taking a closer look at the Autonomous Smart Desk 2 Premium and comparing it to the IKEA Itizen. If you haven't seen these videos before, we like to look at three specific weights comparing each desk performance as we apply these weights to the surface. The weights that we're going to be looking at today and comparing are 100 pounds, 208 pounds, which is the max capacity for the IKEA Itizen, and then finally, 300 pounds for the Autonomous Smart Desk 2 Premium. With that, let's go ahead and get started with the first comparison. Before we go ahead and jump into our first comparison, let's talk about a couple different things. First being the setup. As you can see, each desk has two cinder blocks, a smaller dumbbell, and the weight of the surface to get to the initial 100 pounds for our first comparison. You also see that I have my cell phone here. I'm going to be using this to control the IKEA Itizen through the Linac Desk Connect app. This allows me to move the desk without the use of the handset because it doesn't have a programmable one touch. This is a much easier process for us to use here today. What you wanna look for in the test, the desk gonna start at the same sitting height and at the same standing height. Watch to see how each desk performs through this adjustment range, especially as we add additional weight to the surface as this can definitely impact the desk's performance. With that, let's go ahead and see how they compare on this first initial 100 pound comparison. For our second comparison, we'll be maxing out the IKEA Itizen at 208 pounds. We've also got the Autonomous Smart Desk 2 Premium set to the same weight. Let's go ahead and see how they compare. For our third and final comparison, we'll be maxing out the Autonomous Smart Desk 2 Premium, which again has a max capacity of 300 pounds. We're leaving the IKEA Itizen at its max capacity of 208 pounds. So this will be the max versus max test as we're not going to be intentionally overloading the IKEA Itizen. But we have found through testing that both of these products do not have overload protection, something that you should consider should you decide to go with one of these and be running near their max capacity. With that, let's go ahead and see how each compares with their max versus max. Hopefully this weight capacity comparison of the Autonomous Smart Desk 2 Premium versus the IKEA Itizen gave you a better idea how each desk would perform with the three different weights that we tested here today. Through testing, you could see that the Autonomous Smart Desk 2 Premium product was more consistent and it was able to lift quite a bit more weight as well. Which is best for you will definitely depend on your specific needs for your next standing desk. If this was helpful, please hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. We've got a ton of great standing desk content coming up. Thanks a lot for watching.